it is a bigger problem than what we initially thought. A sickening trend that could actually make you sick. Police stop another truck carrying rotting food to an Indiana store. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Dan Klein. It's the second truck in less than a week that area police have stopped, keeping thousands of pounds worth of spoiling food from making it onto the shelves. News Channel 18's Bill Khan reports state troopers are stepping up enforcement to crack down on trucks carrying rotting food. Dan, it's a special initiative that has been going on for about six months now. Troopers say they take seriously their duty to keep spoiled food off store shelves. The day is cool. But Trooper Ashley Kelly could immediately tell the food stored in this truck headed from Chicago to the Asia Mart Oriental Grocery Store in Indy is not. There's an obvious temperature difference once we got into the truck. It is actually warmer inside the, the back. Trooper Kelly stopped the truck on I-65 in Clinton County because of a traffic violation. She started seeing more serious problems as she began inspecting the truck's load. There's cooked meat that's required to be kept in temp of 41 degrees. That We have temperatures that are in the 50s and even 60s on some dairy dessert products and some meat products. The refrigerator unit never kicks on while the team inspects the products. The more temperature measurements the officers and Clinton County Health Department workers take, the more unsafe food they find. The pile of spoiled items continues to grow. So far, this is our bad pile so far. We have things ranging from pork, cooked chicken items. We have dessert items containing like a cream cheese filling, any kind of dairy products, things of that nature. We have some tofu. This meat even appears to have mold on it. Trooper Kelly says she inspected a truck from the same store last month. I do not believe we had any food violations last month. The two men driving the truck declined to comment on camera. But one told News Channel 18 that all the items were fresh, and this was the first time there has been a problem with their food. Trooper Kelly says this might be the company's first violation, but it's not the first time officers have discovered the problem on Indiana's highways. It is a bigger problem than what we initially thought. We're trying to crack down and make our, our food items safer for our citizens of the state of Indiana. Troopers say it's unlikely they'll catch every truck carrying spoiled food, but they plan to take as many off the road as possible. And that truck was escorted by officers to a disposal company in Frankfurt. There, about three-fourths of the truck's contents were destroyed. Nicole Kahn, News Channel 18.